All right, here's the afternoon update. Not gonna lie to you, the afternoon got away from me a little bit, but that's okay. I worked till after seven o'clock, so I kind of made up for it um, <clears throat> by working a couple hours extra here. Um, so I was able to get that pile that was there and dumped it into the hole over here so that it would give me some structure to build this up um, with dirt and everything and then i just go over there and just i, I didn't want to fill in the whole big hole on their side and, and they're not going to care so i'm just going to grab some of the mound and just dump the dirt on top of there and then when they start doing their <clears throat> big excavating and everything they're going to ruin my wall anyhow and probably tear out the trees and that's something to worry about down the road not not today today that's cleaned up and out of the way um i got all of the hoop house three um sides the wiggle wire tracks off and then also the ribs out a couple ribs where the uh, screws broke that are still there um, and then I got the rest of them sitting over there. I was able to till out that area. Oh no, I guess I did that before lunch. That's right. Um, and then I got some of this stuff cleaned up. Oh, that, that was the big thing. I got the plastic out of here and uh, that was that was huge. Um, that took a while. <clears throat> Cutting it up just wasn't gonna happen. I did. I was able to cut up a, one or two pieces out of it. And so I did get that aspect of it. But, um, so I filled up a bunch of trash cans, quite a few trash cans with um, pipe, piping that was kind of totaled and stuff like that. And uh, we had a bunch of the greens, uh, the weeds and stuff like that from this side and then also over on the other side that were in some. And so we were able to dump a couple of these into some relatively like halfway full ones. Um, so it left enough room to do one trash can full of uh, the plastic and then we hardly had any household trash and so I was able to take the big gigantic load and fit it in to, uh, to it. You can almost see it out there because the sun's hitting it and stuff. So I got all that. Oh yeah, I, I trimmed out the, that's, that's right, that's, uh, I trimmed out the, the volunteers that were happening over there. Um, but I also went into the jungle back here and was able to, oh, that, that looks amazing. <laughs> you don't really notice it until, until it's taken out of there. But that's most of it back there. That's all going to dry out and everything. But uh, yeah, so it's just, this, this uh, stuff right here just continues to volunteer up all the time. Um, next time, if I ever get the excavator again, um, if I can get back in here, uh, that's probably a good idea to get the excavator and just uh, take that out by the root ball so that we don't get the volunteers as much anymore but got that all cleaned up looks a lot better and uh, you know already looks different um, so some of the stuff uh, the piping is still attached and stuff like that so I'm just gonna get that off probably tomorrow and stuff so yeah that was uh, the afternoon um, the the progress doesn't look as much because it took so long to get this pile basically it was you know one or two pieces at a time to take over there and then i worked on the wall building the wall a little bit there and then tossing stuff over there so you know it doesn't look like as much gets done that actually did get accomplished just because basically that that and the and the tarp uh take uh, an enormous amount of time in order to do so yeah it was a pretty successful uh late afternoon and uh luckily we got another day tomorrow on thursday it's supposed to be another nice day so hopefully be able to get a full day's work out of that one too